scam that turned on the scammer. A pharmacy in Woodbury was almost the victim after a man ordered $140,000 worth of diabetic test strips under their name. Channel 3's Courtney Zeller joins us live with more on how the business was tipped off. Courtney? Well, this is a family-owned pharmacy. They wouldn't carry more than a handful of these boxes at one time. So when the suspect ordered more than 700 of these diabetic test strip boxes, it was a huge red flag. It's a scam. Pharmacist Mary Terrell of Canfield Corner Pharmacy in Woodbury wishes she wasn't part of that somebody had called and placed an order under our phone number and our name um, for diabetic test strips for a very large quantity, $140,000 worth. Terrell's distributor called her after that order was placed. They figured it was a scam because they knew she wouldn't have ordered 700 boxes of diabetic strips. Terrell called police. They decided to set up the suspect to think the $140,000 order was in. When he walked in the door with his hand truck, we knew who he was and we went to give him the supposed order and uh, the police officer walked up behind him. 29 year old Jesse Jack was arrested. Eyewitness News was the only one there when he faced a judge in Waterbury today. Tyrell says this scam is going around targeting local pharmacies, but she says you can't fool this one. We are aware of what's going on. Don't put us at risk. Your local pharmacy is already at risk for losing money from the PBMs, losing money from the insurance company. This is our life, this is our livelihood. Now, these diabetic test strips, some aren't covered under insurance, so they can run some patients between $100 to $200 a box. Basically, we're told these scammers are stealing these boxes and then selling them to patients uh, for less money. We are live at the Bubble Newsroom tonight. Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right.